Shadow Over Innsmouth is the one Lovecraft story I would recommend to anybody, regardless of whether or not they're uh, they're a fan of of of. It's easy to follow. It's easy to read. It's legitimately creepy. It has a great ending. Just one. Oh boy. Time for Ada and Cedric. Or Ada Cedric. Or Cedric Ada. I don't know. I don't remember anything. Who even knows anymore? How do I remember to do things? <laughs> Burn. This fucking shit. Yeah, Cedric just happens to have a natural talent for doing horrible, terrible things to everybody. I like that Felix is already taking him in stride. Yeah, I would be taking him an incredibly long distance because he's like legitimately the most dangerous person there. Yare, yare. Uh, at, least, at least in terms of uh, most likely to fly off the handle and be an asshole to everybody. Yeah, absolutely. Really, I feel like everyone's trembling in fear. I wonder why that is, dickhead. You're misinterpreting everything. <laughs> You're not wrong, but it's also not the context here. I understand yeah. that it's not the context. Now that was precisely why I took it off in a different direction. Nara. Just, he looks he looks really comfortable to be here though, so that's nice. It probably isn't that different from the life he was leading before, to be honest with you. He's just, he's just being told who he has to murder now. Yeah. He's like, hey, I get to I get to be a hero after everything I've done. That sounds absolutely hilarious, I mean. <laughs> it's like, great, man, you have to kill someone, you don't even have to hide the body or anything. You can just keep killing. Like, holy fuck, why didn't I think of this sooner? Corn somewhere gets a semi and doesn't know why. I think he knows exactly why. Of course, you're quite Oh my god, he's really giving her this you and me are the same thing. <laughs> also, yeah, to be clear, Blood Raven, um, Dark Corners of the Earth has absolutely nothing to do with Cthulhu directly. The old ones involved in, in that uh, game are Father Dagon and Mother Hydra. Uh, Dagon being, like, kind of a lordling of Cthulhu, so he's not really on the same level as Cthulhu. The other thing is um, ba is basically one, uh, one of the alien races that uh, <laughs> that uh, uh, Love Lovecraft inv invented for Color Out of Space, and um, the thing is, is you only understand how they're how they're involved if you get like the the best ending which has ridiculous requirements in the base game there's a fan patch out to make that uh, make it actually doable <laughs> there's a lot of perfect criminal there's a lot of stuff i haven't done yet like take candy from a baby okay so this line here i'll finish it off when you read it i know what he says here Killing one person is enough to be called a murderer. Okay, okay yeah, the, there was too much text on that particular that particular yeah. um, text box. So. <laughs> I think she just kind of coolly responds. Everyone's heard that before. Shut up. He wants to find out. It's a fair question, I'd say. <laughs> you, got, you gotta admit, for, for like in terms of in terms of psychopathic behavior, he has certainly got one of the most productive forms of it. I mean, he and he's at least consistent about it about his uh, psychosis. Oh, you guys haven't seen anything yet. <laughs> in terms of it's, productivity, this is gonna get a lot worse. Like you, just, I'm I'm really eager to see your reactions to this. Okay, cool. It, we're not there just yet. Here's Gloria knowing him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Um, the only person who's even remotely her age. <laughs> I love his deal with it pose where his eyes are behind the glasses, but then they come up. I, lo I, lo I love how he, he quite clearly just in lo enjoys fucking with people. Yeah, I mean, you mentioned psychopath earlier. So, so sociopath, psychopath is definitely a uh, a moniker that I would attach to him. Blood Raven, um, Jack Walters always kills himself at the end of the game, but there's uh, there there's an extra thing as to why he's important. So, and if you get the best ending, you learn why he's important before his before his lights go out. And also, Azathoth is also known as the blind idiot god of creation. the the entire uh, The entire universe is his dream. So he is sleeping, and if he ever wakes up, then the dream ends, which means the universe ends. So that's a thing. Ah. Uh. Sixteen. Ada is joined. I love how. I always lo I love how. Uh, dang. And uh, so here's where things get. <laughs> so here's where things get complicated. Ada Wong over here. No. 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 But. She's here for one reason aesthetic. and one reason only, and you might have already been at the... Cedric, probably. Oh, no. no. Her story is quite interesting. I'm paying attention. I will say, however, I, I really appreciate Kurt saying, please give a warm welcome to the newest member of the Nameless, and he's scowling the entire fucking time. That's his normal face. Yes, exactly. You said no when I said to kill Cedric. What? <laughs> well, you know. Also, is that like um, is that like a ja that looks like a James Bond gun? That kind of odd. We are in anime Poland, so we're pretty close. Walter PPK, baby. Aren't they... It... Walter isn't German, is it? What? The the company that makes the, the PPK? Arms manufacturer? Uh, the, I don't know. I actually don't know that. Google that. Post haste. Hope. We'll do that. She's got, she's got history with Cedric. And... Cedric. Let me see here. Hold us. <laughs> They're good friends. And by that, good I mean, friends. she's a police officer who's been trying to track him down. But the process of trying to arrest him has ruined her life. <laughs> the arms manufacturer um, is German, yes. Oh, so they're close by. Good. Uh-huh. <laughs> I just I just came back and Cedric is just absolutely loving this shit. <laughs> oh yeah, like he never Ada turning up is like the, a, the, a, 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 Ada turning up here is to him one of the best things that's ever happened in his life. Because it just it becomes so fucking hilarious to him. See, see, she's not here. She's not here to. She's not here to kill him. She's here to make sure he does something wrong. She's there to scoop him up and get him executed. I will say also, Ada's hair. She's not a. She's not a cop anymore, though. No, she can't do that. No, she's not an actual police officer, but she's still doing this anyway. So she's a, she's a private eye. She and uh, she and um, freaking. I'm sorry, his name is escaping me. She's she's not even a private eye. She's someone who is very fucking obsessed. I, I was I was gonna I was gonna make them make another joke, but I was I wasn't smart enough to put it, I put the pieces together. Do it. You're just the same. God as damn it! I love that sound. Yes, indeed. 
like, you're my best friend! Oh, uh, Book Thief, don't ask that question. <laughs> I mean, that seems logical, but Ada doesn't exactly seem terribly logical. <laughs> Robokai, wow, I'm waiting, uh... I'm waiting on you, Robokai. Start laughing. She's already taking the gloves off here. Accidents soon happen in firing. God damn, Gloria! Damn it. I also li I like how she immediately Muffled goes to goes... kill a playing in the background. <laughs> I like how Ada immediately goes to, Oh, I am Cornholio! Are you threatening me? Put the fucking gun down, Ada! Seriously, Jesus! Just take. Will someone please take the pistol off of her? <laughs> it's like an extension of her at this point. She would probably torture. <laughs> Glory, yeah. jeez, wow. No, that was Ada. Oh, okay. <coughs> <laughs> so she finally caught him, but then it's just that happens. <laughs> Man, we were saying that Cedric is 100% troll. Glory is at least 75%. You're just chasing the crap that comes out of Cedric's butt. Good night, everybody. No, you can't leave yet. <sighs> yeah, I'll, I'll fight in a war, too, if that's what it takes to arrest a guy that I'm not even, like, legally able to arrest anymore. Fuck. <laughs> I may have I may have gone a bit too far with this plan. I don't oh, you know not far enough to the parts where it makes sense and doesn't fuck me over. Shit. I might be really bad at this. <laughs> and of course she's she's watching him on the toilet. <laughs> she's just so Why oh. is she so insane when she though she had never mind. Oh my god. <laughs> Stop asking questions you know I can't answer. Oh, fuck. I thought you liked coffee. <laughs> I love that look on his face. Oh, dude, tastes great. <laughs> what are you playing at? He's messing with you, seriously. He's absolute. See, I told you, like, her turning up is like his favorite thing ever. Like, like it's like, hey, you know, war is fantastic. But well, you know what's really fantastic? Fucking with people between battles. It's absolutely just. Fucking with Ada's head. It's great. Wow, and she's still hearing Phantom Pains. Great. Or feeling Phantom Pains, rather. He really doesn't even have to try. Book Thief just sums it up. He's. Th she's just serving this up on a platter. I like how him. we're all zoomed in on this. Like, I can just tell by the, the tone of your voice that you've, like, leaned in you're just like so intently focused I on try this. I try to do that I try to do that <coughs> I try to stream quite a bit actually simply because I've noticed that uh, my voice ends up ends up fading out if I lean back <laughs> worst person in the history of the world have we met anime Hitler yet oh uh, we'd have to watch the anime and he does they apparently do go to the Empire in the anime so I feel like we need a, like a anime night where we comment on that and Listen, upload it we half joking good night yep we know you were cedric thank you for making it official though oh my god saran it's, it's really it's really sad for me uh, for me because like in terms of aesthetics i really like what ada has got i got going on like the short hair the narrow face i really like i like those aesthetics What's between her ears is one massive bag of crazy, though. <laughs> uh, Blood Raven, Lovecraft is considered the, uh, the father of psychological or perhaps cosmic horror. There is no uh, nobody who, who is popularly credited with the epithet father of horror. You deserve to die at the end of the rope. 
Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, he literally just said that. You get to fight with the man who destroyed your life. It's you who made me abnormal. He knows that. Oh my god, she is insane. I think Robokai bowed out. Oh yeah, he did say he, uh, he needed to get ready for work. That's fine. I'm here. I'm good. Let's rock and roll. We're doing this thing. Ada's an okay... She's got high accuracy, but uh, I need more snipers. That'll come into play later. Now what what is what is her okay lancer? Is that her native class? I'm just curious. Bonus is the sniper and lancer. Also, she just has super high accuracy. She's actually sure, it's fine. she's actually more accurate than Serge's, who is supposed to be like the uh, dedicated sniper. She's more accurate than Gloria is too. She, she's the most accurate member of the squad. It's crazy. Give her a good weapon and watch your work. I like the idea that the pistol she keeps waving around is actually just like a pop gun. If she ever, if she ever actually pulled the trigger, a little flag would come out and just said "bang." What does a rangefinder do? Just increase accuracy? Plus 100 range, but this gun has 300 to start with, so it's pretty good. So I'll just get more bullets. Bullets. <laughs> More Daka, as you would say, I'm sure. Mm -hmm. <laughs> nice. Okay, capture camps, no ways. Six turns, wow. A cockeyed grin of his. Fucking fantastic. <laughs> How come you you deploy these people and then immediately send them into standby? Because when it's their mission, they're deployed automatically, and I don't get a say in it. You do. You did have done. Yeah. Sorry. You have done that with a couple of other people as well. Like you do that with Imka every so every so often. Just this stream. Like it, you'll you'll deploy her. Look, and it's then complicated. Okay, fine. Also, what is the what is that symbol representing? Um, representing uh, uh, Mr. Cr Cedric. That's Gunner. It took me a minute to remember his it's name. Like a you know, it's a castle okay. wall or something, because that's all yeah, they yeah, do. Yeah, they yeah, sit yeah. in the camp and shoot at people. Yeah, Jay Soru, I was trying to get him to, you know, explain some of these pro strats, but he declined to do so. Alright, whatever. You do you, loon. What have you done? Are those people dead? No, just the aiming ridicule is all. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You're lying. Oh, that's why you keep ignoring that uh, that one guy. He's just a lancer, so it's not like he's gonna hurt anything anyway. Enemy lancers seem to seem to be like the most annoy or most worthless enemy unit. Oh, wait until they just give you like in VC one when they put all lancers everywhere. It's like the most dickish thing because you. They don't they don't suffer counterattacks because you don't evade in that game because it's you yeah whatever like lancers are just the most bullshit enemy in that game because they can just fire with impunity and they have so much health and defense and you can't counter them which one was how uh, you really feel about them though <laughs> that was vc2 right one one i'm talking okay. about bullshit extra missions oh so they're basically worthless until you set them up in a, in a situation where they are in a very narrow context actually useful. <laughs> yeah. So only, what like, I'm only when it's completely worthless. bullshit. Yeah, they're terrible. 
but if they just put like 20 of them on a field there's nothing you can do because they'll all take turns and in, VC, in vc1 like the enemy pusses out immediately when they get shot so they'll just take a shot they don't suffer any interception fire it's, it's completely unfair and broken that's all i'm getting at here <laughs> But you don't actually have have a have a problem with this, is what I'm hearing. Not in this game. It's more fair in this game. Uh huh. I need those three <laughs> shot sniper rifles. War is Arizona, as we said before. That tank has a flamethrower. <laughs> I like she's not even a police officer anymore, but she still makes the uniform to make it look like she's a police officer. Yeah, yeah that's not that's, that's doing something right there. It's nothing healthy, but it's doing something. Well, everybody, it's been a treat, but sadly, I have somewhere I need to get to. Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So I'll be uh, I'll be absconding early today. Mm -hmm. So everybody have themselves a nice rest of the night, and uh, for however long the rest of the night lasts uh, here in the stream, you've all been a wonderful audience. I'll see you all soon. Be good to yourself, brother. I'll see you on uh, see you on uh, oh, you cannot... Brick in Hold on, my way. <laughs> <gasps> Go sideways through the fucking door. What an idiot! Still an asshole. <coughs> so I have a flamethrower now. Now you have a flamethrower. Ho ho ho. That would have been a much better way to handle Shit. Die Hard. Ah, oh, this guy's getting pushed all over the place. <laughs> Oh man, um. Yeah. Well, that's the end of those guys. Jeez Louise. It's like a. It's like a short range open fire, basically. Until they evade. And then I get really mad. The idea of them evading a flamethrower both disgusts and, uh, and amuses me. Amy, shoot the man. Amy, 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 shoot the man. Relax. It's, it's happening, okay? I know. I'm making fun of uh, fun of the fact that she takes so long to activate sighting. Yeah, it's when you actually like. It's true to its name. It's when you sight an enemy and has a chance of proking. One of right. the most useful things in the game, though, because of the serious accuracy boost you get out of it. I'm, I mean, if your overall goal is to get to the thing and take the flag, though, why do you need a long-range accuracy boost to begin with? Well, I had to kill that guy. He was in the camp. I can't take it if he's there. I understand that, but if you're going to walk up to the camp anyway, why don't you just, you know, press the muzzle of your weapon directly into his forehead and pull the trigger? Because it doesn't matter. He could still evade either way, and also I don't get shot at. Okay, that's a pretty good reason. Because I'm going to leave her there just because uh, maybe I'll do something with it. I was hoping for a reason to start singing Bohemian Rhapsody, but you actually gave a gave a coherent answer for once. You know what? You know what's a bad song? Bicycle by Queen. Oh. That is a really bad one. I remember. Um, I remember there was a car deal a dealership around here a couple of years back that was just like, yeah, we like the licensed songs for our shit, and we really want. I wanted to license We Are the Champions, but you know that was really expensive, so we just got a I got a different. Um, a different Queen song that makes sense for car commercials, and then Bicycle starts playing. It was honestly one of the most infuriating things I've ever heard in my life. Oh, she's useless. Fuck this. Who, Margaret? Yeah, I don't have a good weapon for her yet. Woe is us. Womp womp. Okay, there's no one on this field. There's... God, I should really put someone over here, yeah. Like Layla. Look, I've been I've been talking nonstop for not just the stream, but for like the four hours beforehand. I'm parched. I'm gonna go grab some water. I'll be back in just a tick. Maybe grab some beer, because that would help you cool down. I think. Say what again? Never mind. <laughs> I think. Uh, did you tell me to go grab some beer? Yeah, it might help you cool down. I actually don't have I don't have any decent beer right now. I really need to get to a liquor store. I heard something. I heard good things about something called Kraken Black Spiced Rum. You ever had that? That's not beer. That's rum. Yeah, well, it's still alcohol. Sure. Anyway, to answer your question, no, I've never had. Uh, I've never had Black Spiced Rum of any. Is of there any really kind a fucking difference between rum and beer? Yes. I'll 
go into that when I get back. I'm actually super thirsty. This is the I mean, is there any difference between the world and the here? See, folks, always pack a flamethrower, especially when you're going to the mountains. And that guy's dead. Back that thing up. I've got nothing going on here. Oh, holy fuck. Oh. All right, that's better. So, I don't. I barely even know when uh, know where to start with that. First of all, alcohol content. Most beer has between uh, has between five and eight percent alcohol by volume. With certain light beers have, uh, having less, I think, um, you know, your Miller Lite, your Bud Light will have about 3%, and then the dark, heavy stouts that I uh, that I prefer can have up to 15 or 18% uh, alcohol content. Rum is a hard liquor that will almost universally be at minimum 35%, and sometimes up uh, up to 50 to 55 For uh, Secondly, the desiccants that, uh, that are used to to distill or brew or brew also those two words uh, beer is brewed uh, freaking rum is distilled rum is made is made from sugarcane beer is made is made primarily from barley but it, basically any cereal is considered okay so yeah that's just the first page of all of the things that you just said that were wrong Man, I just I just entered the matrix right there. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, what? You see the you see blonde brunette and redhead? The way I was just kind of like dodging all that machine gun fire. Oh yeah, that I I was I did kind of miss the like ridiculous um the ridiculous spirally acrobatics that should go with any matrix shit. <laughs> どこにいるんだい。ここだ。お。so it is pretty trivial to pop in any uh, the title of any of his his works and come back with a full copy. Shadow over Innsmouth is the one that I, I would recommend you start with. Um, if you have never read any uh, any. Um... Wow. Okay then. This is happening. I'm not going to day. Also die. King D -D -D. King D -D -D. Uh, The one that I recommended you start uh, start with, Blood Raven, is Call of Cthulhu, which is you know the one that primarily deals with Cthulhu. <笑>言っただろ。こんなところでは死なせんと。お前は罪を白日の元にさらし、人の敵、国の敵として死ぬんだ。その日が来るといいな。then die. Procedure is important to this crazy, crazy woman. Inseparable oh my god. Cedric is hilarious. 
Ada basically deserves everything she gets because she keeps egging him on. 